Well, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, everybody. My name is Eva Fattorini. I'm founder um, and director of Artisan and Artisan Digital. I'm speaking from Oxford, United Kingdom. Hi, and I'm Carol Hamill. I'm the digital art therapy consultant for Artisan, and I'm speaking to you from Cairo, Egypt. We are very happy to be invited to share some uh, great news about the product that uh, we are developing together. Uh, Carol, would you mind um, telling us a little bit about it? Absolutely. Uh, so here, I believe that we're uh, on the verge of creating a game changer in the world of digital art therapy. And more specifically, um, you know, we are here creating the first digital platform that would allow our therapists to conduct full art therapy sessions, HIPAA compliant, using digital art making tools integrated at the same time with a live stream mode, like you and I are speaking now, uh, but also having the chance to the client to create art live as they create uh, in the same uh, traditional setting of an art therapy session, but using tablets or using digital platforms to actually create the art, the art right there integrated. I think it's great because as we know, there are a lot of current gaps in healthcare, such as non-ability to address emotional issues, waiting time, inability to have continuous quality of care once the patients leave the hospital, etc. So I think this product might very well address all these issues. You're very passionate about it. You're very committed uh, to it. Why is that? Well, uh, you know, there's a personal story behind this, of course. And to me, this project started way back. Uh, this will be the first time that I share this, but I currently uh, suffer from a rare disorder called PCD, primary ciliary dyskinesia, which is a rare lung disorder. I'm currently about 40% uh, capacity of my lungs, but that doesn't stop me from doing what I love and working. Uh, but oftentimes, you know, I've been in a patient's place. I've been in that hospital bed with all, all the IVs and the lines for weeks and months sometimes, as a child, as an, as an adult. Uh, and oftentimes, you know, doctors always focus on the medical aspect, you know, you know, doing everything that's medically necessary to heal a patient, but they often dismiss the emotional component there. Um, you know, and it's important to uh, keep, you know, uh, giving the patient everything they need, including mental health support. And I remember oftentimes being a patient, if only I had the chance to have an art therapy session. And of course, in hospitals, there's barely therapists, let alone art therapists. Um, so I wish I had this platform right there to have uh, you know, full confidential art therapy session with a trained art therapist while I'm laying there in the hospital bed. So I believe what we're creating here is a game changer because we can help those patients, but we can also help the general population, not only people who are stuck in the hospital bed, but people, you know, who live in a country that doesn't have an art therapist. Absolutely. And probably even tap into some new creative and that's ways. What I'm up with. Right, and you know, maybe even tapping into some opening, some new creative ways to express your emotions using digital art therapy. And what would be the message that you would like to send to the audience? Well, I want to remind every art therapist here that I want you to approach this with an open mind. This is not a replacement for what we do and the way we do it. This is an additional approach to bridge the gap. And it's also, you know, keep in mind that there's an actual uh, trained art therapist behind this. I'm making sure that we create something that's HIPAA compliant that is also meeting with our standards of practice in our therapy. Wonderful. And I'm so looking forward to hopefully soon present the product to the audience or our therapists and our colleagues around the world. Thank you again for inviting us to, to share this with you.